Hello everyone, Delkiller here, and welcome to another Minecraft Dalek Mod video. Today we're in Minecraft 1.12.2, and the latest update of the Dalek Mod is the time of this recording, update 57.1. And today, in lieu of a spontaneous review, which, because of lag and some other technical difficulties, turned out horrible, I will be doing an exploration of something that I haven't yet covered in the Dalek Mod, which is the brand new Gallifreyan Citadel. So I have finally gotten this to work after a little bit of trial and error. I finally just reset my Galfrey dimension and got the Citadel to spawn in. Took a while because of the lag in this computer, but here we go. We finally have it, and I'm going to do a quick exploration of this for you guys. I have not seen this structure yet. This is the first time I've managed to get it in-game. I spent a lot of time trying to search for it in the early updates, but now that it spawns at roughly these coordinates, as you can see on the screen here, you can finally find it in the game rather easily. So let's just head back over here. This is the citadel as it looks like from the outside. This is just an amazing build. This thing is gigantic. The dome itself is kind of smaller than, a, than I was expecting it to be, I guess, but overall this build is much larger than the 1.6.41 and it just looks really, really cool. And so this is just a really awesome thing to find. Uh, I'm not sure how the generation feature of this works, but either way it just comes in here nicely. There's no glitches with the terrain with anything spawning over it or anything like that. It just spawns in. It takes a little while if you're on a computer like mine, which is uh, terribly laggy, but overall this thing is just really cool to see. So this is just a great build, something great to explore, to have a look at, and I think it'd be fun to find this in survival mode, maybe, I don't know, make even make your house here or something. So yeah, overall just it was so awesome to finally be able to see this. I could not find it when it was spawning randomly. So now that they set up a exact location where this spawns at, it is so much easier to find. So here we go. I'm just going to go into the center here. The dome seems to be above us. And I think we have a ladder to go up into the dome. So yeah, I've not, I've not seen this yet. So I might miss some stuff or whatever. But bear with me as I explore this. Oh, here we go. What have we got here? Oh. Would you take a look at that? We have got the doctor statues. Number one, number two, War Doctor, Tom Baker. I mean, we've got a lot of just awesome stuff. Capaldi, food machine. So we've got like a statue room, I guess. It's pretty cool. I'll, I wonder, no, this is, uh, is this supposed to be Day of the Doctor when all the doctors were calling in to write the holograms in that or through the... I mean, they were all there saving Gallifrey. Is this what this is supposed to be a recreation of? Oh, but that's it. So that's why the statues are here, is because all the doctors are going in to save Gallifrey or whatever. Either way, this is... Ah, oh, this is pretty cool to see this. Okay, so I think that's what this is. Anyway, so the ladder keeps going up. And what have we got here? Okay, so we've got a little room in here. We've got some chairs and some desks. So, this is, uh, I can't, I get, there we go, now I'm out of the chair. So, this is where the uh, Time Lords uh, sit here. They watch everybody coming in, coming and going. You gotta pay a fee, I don't know. So, let's keep going up. And this ladder is just like the 1.6.4 Citadel. Okay, and we've reached the top. So, more desks, and we seem to be very high up now, at the top of the dome. Are these supposed to be, uh, image loader blocks? Yep. I'm not sure what they've been named to. Uh, let's see. I'm not even seeing a, a name tag in here. That's weird. I'm not sure what those are supposed to have on them, but could be a generation glitch or something. I don't know. Anyway, so we seem to be at the top here. Kind of meeting room. Great view. Looks nice. So let's uh, pop all the way back down the ladder. This seems to be the central ladder, I guess, through the middle of the dome and everything. So we got a couple of rooms that we can check out in here. The Day of the Doctor one, and then this one, little one right there. Uh, how did I get here? Is this not the way down? What did I do? I did something wrong. Now, this is the only way in and out of this one. Okay, did I... Is there two sets of ladders in here? No, oh, jeez. I came in here, and then I went through the one in the center. 
Can't believe I didn't even realize that. Okay. Now we go down. And here's the day of the doctor room. And finally we go back down to the outside. Okay. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to be able to cover everything in this build in the video. That's just a uh, fly around here. I'm not sure how much there is to explore inside of the dome beyond what we already just saw. Um, that's the area we were just in. It's almost kind of like a fancy thing to look at. But I'm pretty sure there is way more to this build than that. So if we go around to the side here, I think, yeah, we got some ladders that go down. So let's see what's on the lower levels. So we got one area coming up. So this is the lower area below the glass. Oh, this opens up into something. Got a lot of food machines, some bedrock blocks. If this is a reference to something, I cannot remember what it is right now. I know a lot of this stuff is just going to be references to different things in the show. Look at this, we got TARDIS consoles with the uh, Hartner rotors and some TARDIS monitors, some ground O's and everything. So this is like maybe a TARDIS control room, construction room, programming, got some lava. Pretty cool no matter what it is. And this continues out here. I think I saw a chest. Yeah, there we go. So I've got like a storage room maybe. Does loot spawn in these? Maybe not. Apologies for the horrible lag. I see a button in here. I'm gonna push it and see what happens. Absolutely nothing. And I'd say this is the storage room. More ladders, more buttons. And here we've got something interesting, another kind of meeting room. This looks like the secondary council from the fourth doctor. Okay. And another room with a similar color scheme, but oh, 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 this one I do recognize. This is from Trial of the Time Lord. This has got to be from Trial of the Time Lord. This is like the courtroom. Yes. I'm the judge now. I can... Try Time Lords and convict them for accusing the High Council of relocating the position of Earth. I'm getting mad about that. Okay, we got more stuff in here. Oh, we've got a bedroom. Or a prison area, I think. Alright. So I guess this is like a prison? Okay. And in here we've got a library. This is cool. I love this build. Yeah, I got Fast Render back on, and now things are finally fixing the lag. Oh my gosh. Sorry about that. So, yeah, we've got a very nice multi storied library. The only thing missing is a swimming pool. Don't ask me how that makes sense, but there you go. God, that makes a bunch of difference with Fast Render. Holy cow. Had it turned off for you on the inside anyway. So, I love libraries. I could probably stay here all day long, but let's continue with our exploration of the Citadel. So, this seems to be like the, the main level to explore stuff on. I think all the common stuff is in here. All the. Ooh, wow. This is uh, interesting. I don't know what to call this. Sure, it's something matrixy, but yeah, I just I'm blanking on whatever any of this is going to be a reference to. It's been so long since I've seen the Time Lord episodes. Oh, this is very interesting. Another chest. Ah, oh, yeah, this one looks familiar though. Is this where the I don't remember where they found Rodan and in Invasion of Time? I don't know. It's been too long since I've seen any of those episodes, it really has. And here we've got some, like, TARDIS councils or whatever. They're being tested or worked on or constructed. I don't know, kind of like monitors, computer rooms. Grass. Ooh. Very 
high tech. Part of a door. We have half of a door here. Good store frame. Okay. Oh, these, these doors work. That opens into nothing. That opens into nothing. So it's kind of like a green room almost. I'm sure it's. I'm sure it comes from something in the show or whatever. I'm just not remembering it. And this is, takes us back to where we already were, right? We've been in this room, I think. Yeah, there's the lava. Okay. So we have come full circle. Makes me wonder, what, what's in the middle there? I, if I think I miss anything at the end, I'll go into spectator mode. See if there's anything that I did miss. So let's go all the way to the bottom. The lowest levels. Where all the mossy cobblestone is. And this would be that area from Hellbent. The, uh, what was it called? Um, area under the Citadel. Or the Matrix. Infra oh, wow, they got traps in here. Nice. These are filled with harming arrows. Oh, this is dangerous. Be careful where you step. Wow. Yeah, but I, I can't remember what it was called. Um, but they had like the wraith, the wraith things, the time lord like looking things. I don't. Ooh, we get a we get a tortoise shell in here. So this is actually worth coming to. Oh my gosh, I blew it up. <laughs> I saw the pressure plates, and I figured I shouldn't touch them, and I did. <laughs> did John put that there? Either one of them. I just blew the place up. So you can get a tartar shell in here, but it's just really hard to do it. Oh my gosh. I should have known better. But we got some Dalek statues in here. I really did not like how bent, so I... I it, oh, is that going to blow up too? Okay, good. I should watch out where I step. Oh my gosh. Um, yeah, so, yeah, I'm drawing a blank on that entire episode because I really, really did not like it. But this is one of the cooler parts of it, I think. So it's awesome to see this being put under the Citadel. Just the detail and everything. Just, yeah, I love the, I love the booby traps. Now, if they could add those, uh, mob, oh, spider? It's a spider spawner. There's spiders down here, too. Yes. It's perfect. This place needs spiders with all the cobwebs. But anyway, yeah, um... Just those things that were moving around in here, the Time Lord looking thing. I can't remember it at all. Cloister Wraiths? That's the, the thing coming to my head, but Wraiths is from Lord of the Rings. I have no idea. Anyway, just this is pretty cool to see. It's creepy, it's got the right mood and everything. I feel like it should be more cluttered or maze-like, but maybe, again, I'm not remembering the episode very well. So just, yeah, seeing this, and uh, be careful, because you're probably, if you're not, you might blow yourself up like I did. Okay, so that is the lower levels of the Citadel. If we head back up, this is just a couple of rooms, the glass and everything. So there's kind of those two layers below. There's that layer in the middle with really nothing in it. What's this? And then this is the primary area. There's nothing above that. I'll bet those two other layers are kind of right in here where you can't really build anything around them because they're just the cylinders there. So yeah, I'm going to go into spectator mode now and see if there's anything that I did miss. Maybe any Easter eggs or something. I'm not sure. Like, is there anything inside here? These just seem blank. So we just got the kind of the main levels here. It is what it appears to be, but there is so much stuff underneath. So let's head back down. And just a lot of detail went into this build. It's just really cool. So here's the kind of the center area. Oh, and in the center, okay, that's why. I was like, what, what's, what's in the center of these though? Cause I was in here and it kind of goes around the outside. So I was like, is there anything in the middle to answer that question, the build, the way it is, that entire outer ring on the upper level goes around here and there's just this gap in the middle, which is where nothing could go in there. So that explains a lot. And then, if we keep going down, we enter kind of the cloister area. So that's kind of the entire... 
Is that a Time Lord spawner? I think that's a Time Lord spawner. That's uh, yes, it is. There it is. He just spawned. So there is a. Hey, Emily just broke into the area down there. So we do get Time Lords that spawn here. There it is, nice and hidden. Hello, Time Lords. It's nice to see you guys. I'm going to kill you over and over again and steal your regeneration energy. Okay, let's go down here. I think that's it, though. I think that's pretty much it. We got... Uh, I'm seeing these black areas. Are these more spawners or just... Not sure. There's another spawner there. Okay, so yeah, I think that's what there is here. Just a lot of cool rooms underneath and then that whole dungeon area at the bottom. I can't remember what it's called for the life of me. And I think that is the Gallifreyan Citadel in the Dolph Mod. So just really great if you love Doctor Who. If you, I especially love the Time Lord episode. So it's awesome to see something like this in here. Bunch of references I'm sure that I am not getting, which I should be. And just a lot of cool stuff. So this is an awesome build. This is a great find and you can finally get to it by traveling to these coordinates. And it might take a few minutes on a slower computer, but eventually this will boot up and you can find this in the Dalek mod, which is the ultimate Doctor Who experience in Minecraft. And this is more proof of that. So that's just my review of the Citadel, just my explorations of it, kind of my first impressions and everything. Thank you guys, as always, for watching this video. I, I'm not touching my keyboard right now. I'm still moving. Weird. There we go. Sorry about that. Um. Thank you, as always, guys, for watching this video. Um, hope you enjoyed the video, the content. If you did, you can leave a like, leave a comment below, letting us know what you think of this awesome build in the Galfrain Citadel, in the Dolph Mud. And looking forward to update 58. Hopefully I can get an update 57 update video out very soon. And as always, guys, thank you for watching. I'll see you all in the next video. So goodbye for now.